I want to do. I'm doing cars. Boys, I'll be real. I don't know if I can even push this. Well, boys, it appears we have a garage. All right, boys, I don't know how well you can see this Ford is freaking tailgating us, dude. Oh, wait, we're towing the Ford. Oh, live the Raptor. Does not stop very well, but the downshifts help. That's right, folks. A full-fledged 6 7 power stroke on the trailer behind the Raptor, and the Raptor is doing phenomenal. Like, I could not ask for a better tow rig. I'm sorry. We have a new addition to the family you guys kind of met. Not really yet. Uh, his name is Dexter. He's uh, just adopted him from the shelter. Same shelter we got being met. But, um, yeah, he's, uh, he's a little shy guy. A little shy. You'll see him in a little bit. I've fixed this truck probably three times now. Uh, all right, this road is absolutely terrible. And yeah, we're fixing this for them today. It was in a collision yesterday and we're gonna try to get it back up and rolling because they need this thing to do work. Boys, first project on the chopping block. We have an 11 F-250 power stroke from my great friend, Eric. They got a little fender bender here. We got to do a bumper, condenser, secondary radiator, put the grill in here and all this good stuff. We got all the parts from Ford today. In the Raptor, everybody's like, is it a shop truck? No, man, it's a personal truck, um, actually. So Raptor is a shop truck according to uh, the local Fort Mill Ford. So shout out to them having all the parts getting us that stuff and um yeah so let's uh dive into this day boys maybe a little bit of a uh, in the life um of what's been going on recently we have no garage still i know it's very disappointing very sad but it's not that sad because today is thursday our garage comes in monday we get the garage Monday, folks. We we get the freaking garage Monday, boys. So I am super stoked. It was supposed to be this Monday, but it uh, rained and obliterated the yard yet again. So garage next Monday, crossing fingers, praying that everything goes good so we can work in a cool environment. Bought this canopy yesterday because I had to work in the rain and there was like a wind blowing sideways. and It was absolutely crazy. The M3 is in there of all the tarps around it. We are super ghetto right now, but we are doing pretty freaking solid for what we have. All right, boys, we are T-minus an hour. I just got the call that they are delivering the building within the freaking hour, so it's super exciting. They're supposed to be here between 9 and 11. Looks like they're going to be a little late. Not a big deal as long as they get here. I really don't give a crap at this point, so. But thankfully, building's here within the hour. I'm going to go out there, kind of film the process, ask we can do a time lapse, have the camera rolling the whole time, and I cannot wait for this process, guys. We're not even started yet, and it feels like... It just it's a beautiful feeling i can't wait i got a little bit of butterflies in my chest right now and it's just give you a little bit of insight here it's more of a vlog video i guess on day one of the garage official garage build because um the rest has just been kind of landscaping so well, let's dive into it and we're here boys we are delivered kind of majorly well boys current status they did not get done this is currently 7.30 in the morning. They said they'd be here at seven. Also, um, nowhere uh, near here, not available. So, uh, but yeah, we're hoping it's just done today at this point. Um, I'm not looking too shabby though, not looking too shabby. I'm a uh, freaking stoked, boys. I am freaking stoked. Now to have an epoxy the floor party tonight. All right, boys, in the midst of them doing the building, we're almost done with that. Um, Making very good progress. I have got all the cooling in this, AC charged for our little system for right now. We are in the process of doing the grill. I got the old grill torn apart behind me. New front is right there because that's all I needed. Luckily, everything else was good. So I'm popping this into the centerpiece. Then I'll go about getting everything together and then this truck will be done for Eric to pick up, boys. It's a disaster right now, but we are making solid progress throughout the whole time. Building's going up, we'll be done today. Okay, grill is on. The bumper trim did not fit very well. As you see, I have some glue on it to kind of help fit it down. It just kind of was like a roller coaster, really wavy, but the new grill is on. All good stuff. We're going to wipe it down and clean it off. Probably get all the mud off once I get out of the driveway because it's kind of impossible to not have mud on the truck right now. But we are done, boys. This is what it looks like after fixing it. I'll drop a picture of what it looks like before. And this is now. So truck is complete, ready to go. Super happy with it. Let's get it. To our next topic which would be the garage it is coming along very nicely we have the insulation going on the roof right now we have the walk-in door in we're looking like we're about to put the two or the three excuse me 10 by 8 doors at the front and i'm freaking excited boys it is coming together coming together very nicely very nicely making progress Well, boys, it appears we have a garage. 
appears we have a building. Um, I don't know what you boys are thinking, but I'm thinking this is freaking sick, dude. It is such a long time coming. I am over the moon. I, I, I don't have words for this, boys. I don't have words. Um, thank you for Caitlin helping make this possible, help being here, ordering the stuff, making sure we got the right stuff on time, helping with all the whole process. It's just, it's amazing. Would have been not done in this time without her. So shout out to my beautiful wife, Caitlin. Um, boys, it's just amazing. I don't, I don't have words. Um, it's a, it's a little moment for me. Um, it's a little hard to engulf and take in and seeing like all the dreams coming to fruition right now. Everything kind of coming about and just um, everything we've worked hard for and tried to accomplish um, being here at this first um, property we've owned. And I'm just, it's a bittersweet moment. I wish Caitlin's here with me. She's in an online class for um, college real fast. But yeah, guys, it's just... Um, I don't know what to say. Thank you guys. Thank you for all of this. Um, and this is a new channel. It's not exactly the old channel, but it's still the channel. Um, it's uh, a new beginning to that channel. And I um, just want to thank you guys for being along this journey. If you followed this from QCRC, if you um, followed this journey through me as just being me, um, thank you. It means the absolute world to me. And I cannot stress that enough. You guys are amazing. I love you so much. And thank you for everything. And this boys, this is just the beginning. Let's dive inside. Right, here we are walking up to the door walking up to the freaking door got the key probably an electronic lock on this and we're inside boys we're inside oh my gosh it's dark as heck in here here we are boys door one door two And door three, boys. Oh, man. Oh, man. It's just bittersweet. I can't get over it. I'm sorry. I'm just, I'm just being, being this way right now. But, dude, it is so freaking awesome. I cannot wait. I'm so excited to share you guys everything that's got going on, everything we're going to have going on, and also going into this. It's supposed to absolutely obliterate here tomorrow, like rain, like hell. So I don't know if I'm going to be able to try to get the M3 up this slope. Me and Chase have not had time to better go get more dirt and gravel and bring it up here. Plus, I didn't know what kind of truck these guys were going to have and if they were going to demolish the dirt like everybody else has. They kind of ruined stuff there. Not their fault. It's just the ground is so soft here. So we we'll maybe try to get the M3 in here tonight. I know we're going to try to move majority of the stuff tonight and try to get all of that worked in so that way we can work in here the later this week. Yeah, boys. Uh, here we are. Here we are. This is freaking exciting. This is freaking awesome. Dude, I'm so happy. Got the little office thing right here, hang out. Gonna have our little sink and stuff right here, have our washing thing, um, all that cool stuff. Shelves on the whole back wall. Beautiful lighting at the top. Boys, I am just stoked. Look what we already have. Look what we already have. We already have running freaking water. And power is right there. We um, need 40 two by fours. 14 of those. We gotta go get drywall and everything else. Me and my element here. This is kinda not what I do. I build cars. I don't I don't build house stuff, but um we're doing it. We're doing it. Boys, I'll be real. I don't know if I can even push this. Oh yeah, alright, we're moving, we're moving. I feel like all these two before are gonna fall off. Can I just give this to the front lady? Can I do that? Because I need drywall over there. Right, we are gonna push this to the corner and pray that no one gets it. And I'm just gonna come back for it. What do you think? What people do? Is that what you do here? I have no idea. Leave that, leave that. Stop drywall, boys. Wood, drywall, door, 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 door. Not what we want, not what we want. Okay, I'll be honest, I have no idea what to do. Um, I know I want the M3 over there because we're gonna have the office here. I got all the supplies for it today, uh, but the office will be built today. Chase and his dad are coming to help me with that. That's awesome. Have a little bit of storage over top of the office, but as far as this goes, I don't know like what I want that bay to be, this bay. I know this just has to be the wash bay because it's got the drain in it and I'm perfectly cool with that. So this will be kind of the detailing side. I'll we'll have like the pressure washer set up with the water purifier here and all that good stuff. But as far as like where I want everything, guys, I have no idea. I could use like 10 more of those freaking shelves. I have this wood shelf right here I have uh, saved, which uh, we will see how it plays out. Um, it's a, it's a, it's here, boys. It's a work in progress, but. Which yeah, I don't exactly know what I want to do. Um, so we're, we're going to see. We have a um, car being dropped off in the morning, potentially two cars. One maybe um, Saturday morning or tomorrow morning. And um, so, yeah, and then we have Caitlin's birthday party in the building of her family. Um, Saturday. Today is Thursday, about 124. 
Mm-hmm. Yep. Alright boys, the crew is here chasing his dad. Get all the materials in the shop. And now we are ready to officially start framing this office. I am excited. Chase is already doing the nailing, so I'm gonna take it from a timeline here, boys. Let's enjoy. Now, yes, for a majority of this, it's going to look like I am doing absolutely no help because I am out of my element. I'm just like a bug on the wall trying to absorb all the knowledge I can get out of these guys. Super thankful for them. This garage would not be complete without these two. Shout out to Chase and his dad. I love these guys. Thank you guys so much for watching this. You guys are awesome. Let's get to building this. But not too shabby, man. Not too shabby. Get one and nail it all together and it should be wrong. So eight. We'll do we'll do seven and three quarters. Yeah, seven and three quarters would be great. 